Actually, this is a review on this kayak I just got. It's an inflatable. Um, I did get this for my birthday. Uh, but I haven't done a review of it. I'll have a um, the testing of it. I'm going to do it in the ocean. I'm going to dad's right now so I'll do like a test in the water for it. It comes on like this backpack. Um, the paddles you can just attach on the side. There's three sections. It's pretty much to fit it in. Need to just loosen pretty much everything up. Get it aligned the best as possible. Because it's easier to paddle that way. You can like crook it any way you want. Um, this is where you hold and you paddle. Um, you still have that back side. Alright. That's probably a yeah. It's eight foot paddle. Here's the pump. There's a tells you which way is it deflates and inflates. So this is inflate. Even says on there it says inflate and then deflate. Right on the little part. Tells you which. You have different nozzles. Let's put that aside. And it's probably about eight pounds or something. Uh, I'll put the Amazon link to this in the description. If you want to know any, any other information about this, it is on there. And this is like the kayak I really, really wanted. Something you can like backpack into different parts of like lakes and stuff, and I would fish off this. I'll have fishing videos coming out sometime on this. Um, there's numbers on here to tell you which ones to do. Like one, two, three, four, five. Oh, there's one right there. That's one, that's two, three, four, and five. Okay. So, here's this. Let's switch it to this nozzle. It's kind of like a, it's not the smallest nozzle, it's one of the three. automatic uh, when you push it down on this it automatically inflates it I'm going to show inflating this number one and then I'll inflate the whole thing and come back after oh and when you pull it up and push it down it inflates it I'll be back after I inflate this whole thing. Alright guys, that took a little bit, but I got it done. Um, this is actually the chair that goes where I'm sitting. You don't have to put the backpack on there. Um, the backing on this pillow is pretty comfortable. Um, you can actually take this front piece right here, 
like webbing on the front right here so you can um, put your gear up there. And there's another spot on the back that you can put some more gear. Uh, but pretty cool stuff. Um, the paddle can hook on the side so you can just pop the paddle off when you want to move or you put it there and then you can like cast down and fish. Um, you have to be careful with fishing so you don't um, hook this with your lures or anything uh, so you don't like pop it because it is inflatable but I do have real kayaks um, but this is for not really normal fishing this is more or less like if I have to hike toward the trail like this one place called Florida Lake and it is about a fourth of a mile hike in so I just with all my gear, fishing gear, camo gear um, this just would be a lot easier so I could like just strap this on the back of my fishing bag but pretty cool um, there's going to be vids coming out with us uh, the test of how it floats. This goes up to I think over 400 pounds can go on this. Um, I'm way under that. I'm like 236 or 38 pounds. Um, so I could put a lot of good gear on this. You could actually fill this up and like go for a adventure or something but Pretty cool stuff.